On Spotlight today is young diploma student from the University of Lagos, Marion Franklin, who lived her life as a tomboy basketballer, but recently discovered her feminine side in modeling. She's selected as one of the few to strut to the catwalk of the forthcoming African Fashion Week Lagos. Take a look. The African Fashion Week Lagos is just weeks away, and this group of professional models who have walked some of the biggest catwalks in the Nigerian fashion world are getting ready. One of them, however, is different. Marion Franklin. She is a first-timer who never thought her dream of modeling would ever come true. My name is Marion Franklin. I'm from Kogi State. And I grew up in Bariga. I know Bariga is like one of the rugged areas in Lagos that everybody knows. The whole distance I... Born and raised in the Lagos suburb Bariga, Marion's interest has always been in basketball up until recently. Get them either. This is my time. My time where I leave the world behind. Headphones on, world off. Even though she has got good heights, her statistics doesn't fit in the slim model stereotype, so she never thought she could be one. Against all odds, she is now being styled for a pre-event photo shoot by one of the biggest names in Nigerian runway fashion, Modella. Why I said modeling brought out the feminine side of me? Now I have to. I am now more sensitive of how I dress. Playing basketball, I have this mindset like I can just wear my joggers, my palm, my shirt, and go out. I don't mind wearing just my sport tube and all that. But now modeling. I would have this man, I would sit down, what can I mix together to bring out this particular kind of dressing as a girl. Uh, for the first time I could wear my sport, my, like I could wear something like, like a girl, slim, like body hog shirts, gowns, and I'm not shy. Take care of my skin and all that that I don't do before. Now I'm like, oh, I need to get a good soap for my skin, I need to get a good cream for my skin, I need to make my hair and all that. So that's really brought out the best out of me. I'm, get, I'm discovering myself as a girl. Modeling crossed her mind after seeing her older sister Francesca get a few gigs as a photo model. The first is my elder sister. Her name is Francesca Franklin. She's a model too, but for facial stuff. I admire her so much because she's so pretty. We call her Fulani. She looks so much like Fulani with the old long hair and all that. And at the point, I felt like I can't do modeling because, um, because of my body. They're like, they need size six and you have to be slim and all that. And growing up, I'm noticing that I am going to be very huge. So I diverted into basketballing. I had that mindset of playing basketball. Boyo. Good. Just stay there. When I saw the when they posted it to our group chat, like everybody has to participate in this in my trial look, I was like, can I go? I said, yeah, you can go. I said, my size, say, yeah, you can go. So I tried my look. I never knew I performed well. I never, like, I just did it. I was like, I was scared because I saw people were better. I saw people were like, when you see them, you know, yes, these are professional models. When they walk, you see the best. Like, you be like, can I do this? I felt discouraged. But later on, something just told me, just be yourself. Just do it how you know it. And I did it. She is eventually scouted by the founder of the African Fashion Week, Ronke Ademiluyi, who has curated runway events in Lagos and London for many years. She and her team picked her from hundreds of other fresh and experienced models who have signified interest. Um, her height, you know, um, her confidence, you know, the way she walks, you know, her skin, you know, that just the whole package together, you know, is what made us choose her. So every year we make sure, and this is both in London and Nigeria, we make sure that we use a lot of fresh faces in the industry because our platform, you know, it acts as like a springboard for models, for designers, even most of our designers as well, you know, showcasing this year and the previous years as well, 
for them it's always the first time. Yeah, I'll go. Come on. Go get them, <laughs> Getting on the show is of course a big deal to Marion. I got a call that was selected and I was like, everybody at home could not rest because I was just shouting. I was happy. And running the show for the first time, my first Everything right now is my first time. I'm just so it's like it's just too fast. But I just feel grace when, when they say when it's when the time is ready, God would make it happen. And my parents, they are excited. They are excited. Although all this thing happened, I didn't tell them at first. I just I was just doing it on a low key. So now I told them now and they're like, I'm the last one of the house. So they're like, okay, yeah. She's doing things herself now. They are excited, like you're now growing and you're thinking well and all that. So they are really excited. With the African Fashion Week Lagos just around the corner, Marion is set to take advantage of this big opportunity as she gets ready to begin a new chapter in her life. Go get them, girl. You got this, okay?